Okay, I'm going to show you how to create custom icons in GNOME. Um, I'm using GNOME 3.12 here on Fedora 20. This works with GNOME 3.10 also. I haven't tried any other versions and it also works in Ubuntu GNOME. Um, it works for me in Ubuntu GNOME also. I don't know about any others but as long as it has this program it should work. So we'll open up a terminal and we're going to install something called a la carte. So sudo yum install a l a c a r t e and sudo password and I already have it installed. So that's what you'll type in right there or apt-get or whatever distribution you're running. Um, so now that it's installed we'll come up here and type in a la carte and it will pop up as main menu. So we're going to do new item and I'm going to use Firefox Natly for this example. Uh, you can do whatever you want for this. Um, so I'm going to type in Nightly for my name. And then I'm going to browse for the uh, executable. So I have it in downloads Firefox and Firefox. And it's created. However, there's no image for it, as you can see. So if we come here and go to Nightly, you'll see it just shows up as its original icon. Um, so we'll come here. So let's go to the internet. Let's actually open up Nightly, and um, yes, make it my default browser. Um, Nightly. That's, oops, icon. So I already have this one downloaded right here. It's a .png. You want it to be a .png for the transparent background image. And the resolution was too large, so um, here we go. I have it right here. We'll open it in GIMP. And we'll convert it. Why not? Um, and here we go. So when you use this image, at least for me, it wouldn't let me create it because the icon was too large. Um, so I scaled it down by going image and scale image and I made it 100 pixels by 100 pixels. Then you just do export as then type in the name, click export and all that stuff. Um, I already have the icon right here. So let's go ahead and go back to a la carte and we'll go to properties and there's this little icon right here you click on and then we'll go and find um, the image. So I named it nightly.png. Just click OK. And there you go. Go ahead and click OK and your icon is now fixed. You have an image. Um, oh. Uh, this was really hit and miss for me. It seems like you have to trick um, a la carte. Um, I just tried it a second go to, for a trial run and it ended up working that I could use the .png image. However, every other time I had to do this little trick uh, where for some reason it only recognizes .jpg images and um, obviously you don't want a .jpg just because it has the white background and there's no transparency. So go to your image that you just created um, and you're just going to rename it. So right click and rename and get rid of the .png and change it to .jpg for JPEG. And that's all you have to do. Um, we'll go back down here and let's find the image again. Pictures natly.jpg click OK and then OK and we'll come take a look and it's not working this time, oh no let's exit out oh bother I'll give us another trial run here So we'll delete this. Let's 
Nightly Firefox. And pictures. Nelly.jpg. Okay. Okay. Now it's created. And there we go. Um yeah, it, it's it's a little bit buggy. Actually I'll say buggy at best. Um but it works and you can get your own custom icons. Um if it does this is the only way I've been able to get it to work. If there's any other better uh solutions that you might know, let me know. Um this is what worked for me and yeah, if, if you have any questions just leave a comment or whatever. Hopefully it's helpful.